Hi, my name is Penn Gillette. This is my partner, Teller. We're Penn and Teller, and we're in lovely San Francisco. No, really, this isn't like an ultra matter blue screen thing. We are really in San Francisco. Honest. Swear to God. And you know, I never visit my beautiful city by the bay without thinking of when Teller and I met Stephen Banks a little over 10 years ago here. Yeah, Stephen Banks. And speaking of swearing to God Almighty, the show you're about to see, Stephen Banks Home Entertainment Center, is a live show, shot live in San Francisco, and what you're seeing is exactly what those people saw on that historic night when it was shot. I'm sure you read about it. One night, no edits, nothing. I want to say a little thing to people there who are interested in breaking into show business. If you have no talent and no natural abilities and want to be on television, you can always learn to do something like this. If, however, you're charming, lovable, funny, witty, and can play every musical instrument known to man, you can do something like this. Stephen Banks, Home Entertainment Center. It's time for the Stephen Banks Show. And here he is, the star of our show. Stephen Banks. One, two, one, two, three, four. My name is Stephen. How the hell are you? I said good evening. Hi, how the hell are you? This is my show, in case you didn't know. Yeah, so sit right back, don't have a heart attack or a stroke. We're gonna have lots of fun, I'm gonna sing songs under you. Cause I like the Bruce Springsteen, and I like the Who. I like Bob Dylan, when he was a Jew. I like the Costellos. And the other Elvis too. But I don't like a Charles Manson, Adolf Hitler, or Rob McEwen's poetry. I like to have lots of fun and sing my song for you. I like to have lots of fun and sing my song for you. <laughs> Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we'll be right back with the Stephen Banks Show after these very important messages. Hi, this is Amanda Thompson. I came over the other night with my dad to look at your drum set, and I think I want to buy your drums. So I think I'll be coming over in the morning to pick them up. Um, I really like your drum set, so, so I think you have a sale. Bye. Goodbye. Eggs. Happy anniversary to us. Happy anniversary to us. Happy anniversary to the cutest couple in the world. Happy anniversary to us. We're nice, we, on this very special day. I've got a big surprise for you, but you're going to have to call me to find out. Um, don't forget, our reservation is for 7 o'clock. I've got to go now, but you call me to No, 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 please, no, no! <laughs> Call me. Mr. Banks, this is Mr. Bolt's secretary. 
Barry again. Will you please call me as soon as you get in? This is very important. No, I won't. <laughs> I hope this is the same Stephen Banks I went to high school with. Uh, this is Lance Crawford. Lance? Now, listen, I, I gotta talk to you, man. It's really important. Call me at... Uh, I don't know where we are, so I'll call you when you get back tonight, when you get home from work or whatever it is you do, okay? Talk to you later. Lance Crawford, I don't believe it. God damn it, I hate these things. Thanks. This is Mr. Buttle. Where the hell are you? You've done it again. You have done it again. In exactly one hour and five minutes, I'm giving a speech to the stockholders and the board of directors. A speech written by you, Mr. Banks. Where the hell is that speech? It was supposed to be on my desk, and it wasn't. Jeez. We turned your goddamn office upside down trying to find that speech, and we couldn't. So typical of you, Banks. Please, please, please. You better have that speech. It better be in my hands in 45 minutes, or you can kiss your job goodbye. Oh. Goodbye! I wrote that speech. I think. Yeah. yeah. Hi, this is Stephen Banks. Can I talk to Mr. Buttle, please? Mr. Buttle. Uh. <coughs> Hello, sir. Oh, geez, I'm so sick. I had to. I had to leave work early. I was. I was throwing up. It would. No, no. Look, 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 look. No, the speech is here, and I can get it down to like about an hour. How does that sound? Forty minutes? Uh, sure, that, that, that's fine too. I. No, no, sir, no, sir. Believe me, I promise this will never happen again. No, no, no. I mean it this time. <laughs> yes, sir. Yeah, oh, okay. It. Yes. Okay, sir. Great, sir. I will see you soon. I gotta go. I think I'm gonna throw up again. Oh no! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the Stephen Banks show normally scheduled at this hour will not be seen tonight. In order that we may bring you the following special program, Mr. Buttle's speech. Bum, 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 bum,
And now the end is near And so I face the final curtain I ran to say it near and did it my way 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 Who killed the king of rock and roll? Tell me, I just got to know. You can't blame us, said his mom and dad. We didn't know what we had. He wanted a bike when he was 10 years old. We got him a guitar, how are we to know? So who killed the king of rock and roll? Tell me, I just got to know. You can't blame me, said Priscilla Bow, you. I loved him more than any of you. I married him, I divorced him too. It's all in my book at a store near you. <laughs> so who killed the king of rock and roll? Tell me, I just got to know. Not I, said little Lisa Marie. I loved him and he loved me. He was my dad legitimately. He named his airplane after me. When I get all of his money, I'll give it to Scientology. <laughs> so who get up a king the rock and roll? Tell me, I just got to know. <laughs> Not I, said the loyal fan. I love the king, I love the man. He didn't smoke. He didn't drink, he didn't take drugs, no matter what you think. He was a Christian man, he believed in God. Not like those devil-worshipping, heavy metal slobs. So who killed the king of rock and roll? Tell me, I just got to know. Not I, said Ted Kennedy, it was a CIA conspiracy. I pulled him out and he swam free. Wait a minute, excuse me, I'm in the wrong song. <laughs> My apologies. <laughs> so we killed the king, the rock and roll. Tell me, I just got to know. Not I, said Elvis. I can't be blamed. Like to see you deal with that kind of fame. I was poor white trash. Turned rich white king. Imagine having everything. Imagine having everything. Elvis has left the building. 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 Elvis, two points left the building. Elvis has left the building. Elvis gotta write a speech now. Elvis gotta write a 